Sargon, Destroyer of Worlds here, and thank you for joining me for another episode of City Skylines. And we are back here in Bytown. Welcome back. We are at uh, our waste treatment facility that we built last episode. And as you can see here, it is a large complex and it will be able to handle all of our waste uh, water uh, needs uh, for the foreseeable future and maybe for the rest of uh, this series. So not too far off from our main development here, but we didn't finish everything with respect to our water needs. And in fact, we'll come back out and we'll have a look. We are still teetering on availability of water because we did not, and let's come in here, we did not uh, decommission these two guys, uh, these uh, water pumps that come with the base game. We did decommission over here uh, the treatment plants that we had that come that did come with the game. So we do, we will take care. Excuse me, we will take care of this this episode and replace these. But before we do that, there are a couple. Oops, there's a couple of things we need to deal with. And first, we're going to come over here to our historical church build. And it may not be apparent, but I noticed this while doing a cinematic. Uh, and I don't know why I did it, but this road actually does not connect. So what we will do is we'll come in uh, and we will connect this up. We're also going to come in and remove uh, basically vehicles except for in fact if we come along here except for our service vehicles that we need to come through and I'm not quite sure which one hearses are but if we do that that should prevent them all except the hearses that come in like that fellow uh, that just disappeared and came back there we go so that will decrease some of the traffic that's coming around here and more importantly uh, stop this really weird uh, turnaround business that was uh, going on Ooh, uh, we might actually have to look at expanding and putting in uh, some more cemetery services here either here or elsewhere in the build but that's not today we just wanted to fix that that is now fixed so if we come and have a look, there's one other thing we want to deal with before we get to the adding water pumping stations. Uh, elementary school is fine. We did add some university uh, capacity. Uh, it is teetering and almost to the red, but that's not where we need help. Today, we need to work on our high school availability. Uh, you know, we are definitely undergraduating students. And if we look here, we actually only have, uh, looks like two high schools, one in this neighborhood here and one over in this larger area. So we're going to come in and we're going to add one in here. And I have this spot picked out. You know, it's a nice open area in a area without any high school. Uh, so we won't have to demolish anything. So let's come in. Let's quickly take care of our high school needs. So first off, we'll come in and I will grab this high school here. And I think we'll place it on this side. Might need to use move it a bit. Uh, we will come in and then add a parking lot. We have a parking lot. We'll come in with Bob and we will remove all the parking spaces. So we have that. And I do want to add in a basketball court. So I have a basketball court here and we will put this next to the school. But we're going to use... Oop. Okay, let's try that again. School goes there. And we'll use move it to adjust this basketball court. And we'll get it close enough. Okay, so it still thinks it's got a road connection. And let's just have a come in and look at Bob. 
Feels like I've missed some. I must have reset it. There we go. Let's just get that. There we go. And I have my notifications off. Yeah, that's what I thought. This just needs to be a little closer. There we go. So now that has um, access. So we'll have one basketball court over here. The next thing we're gonna do is come in and add a park. So I think instead we'll just use this small park. So let's get rid of that paved path there. We can come in and we will pull this this way. And this will allow uh, us to put a gravel path right going behind the school. Then we'll come in and we will pull that school right up to the path and we will come in with surface painter and take care of the gaps here. I think this looks, looks a lot better. And let me just quickly uh, do a few other uh, trail connections. So there we go, nice uh, little high school with a basketball court, a park, uh, some play area. Now, if you notice, um, well, and you probably noticed as I was placing it, we have this off ramp. So I did download some sound barriers. And the reason why I downloaded some because the ones that come with the game put sound barriers on both sides. And I would prefer drivers be able to see this as they come in. So let's uh, let's see how well. Actually, let me let me show you her. So turn off collision. That's what the sound barriers would look like. If you're coming in, I guess you could still see some of this. Obviously, the big rock formation. But I'm going to try instead to use some sound barriers. Uh, so let's see how well these work. That's uh, one sound barrier prop uh, in. So we'll have a look. I might uh, try to touch up a bit in the detailing episode or uh, time, uh, the detailing time lapse because as you can see, some things just aren't very straight. So, and I could probably fiddle with this for my OCD to be happy. But I think we're good. I think we're good for now. So nice little high school in here. Uh, and that should be dealing with... Uh, well, we got up into the yellow. So we'll have to look uh, in another episode uh, where we want to add another high school to take care of some of our educational needs. So that's done. Now the next thing is these water pumps. Uh, I did download some nice Avania assets and where I want to put that is right along here, actually in this area. But what I want to do is actually run a key wall right along here. Uh, and this will allow us to expand in this area a little further because if we look, there's a massive uh, slope issue here. So we're going to have to deal with that. And one of the ways we're going to deal with that is putting in a key. Uh, so let's put one in right now. So now that we have our key in, we are just going to do a little bit of landscaping. We'll come in here. And let's try that again. Yeah, just the brush size. We'll just smooth out a 
pat along here. Now we'll come in and fix my little error here with the actual water level. That should be good for now. So what we will do is prep some future infrastructure. Uh, we're just gonna take uh, this collector and we will curb it. And we'll do something with that a little later. So let's come back down here now that we've got our collector in with Tree Anarchy on. Ugh. One of these days, one of these days I'll learn. So let's just come into the forest brush and let me fix that mistake. Okay, so we fixed that. Uh, we will come in and use our industrial roads. Now down here, we're just gonna use our 1U. Put those down. We will first come in and then add in our much needed parking. And that's because we will now use, I believe it's pumping station number two. Yeah, this is the one we want. We're gonna come in, I'm gonna select this one. We will actually merge them together like this. Make sure it's the same height. And that's a drain pipe we have running down. I think that's looking pretty good. Now the other more important thing is here is with our spawn points and they're out here. So I think we're good. So we have this in here. So we now need to get this road up to the collector. So let's run this up. So let's check out uh, how steep this slope actually is. Ooh, but I think we can smooth that out. That gray doesn't look too, too bad. I think, I think we can live with that. So let me just do a little smoothie smoothie of the land here. That looks a little better. Now, the other thing we're gonna do is a lot of these areas have parks around them. So, let's, uh, so we will remove these trees here. And we're gonna come in and park. So we have our park in. Now both these things will require electricity, which at some point in the near future, we're gonna have a look at some of our solutions for this area about how to improve how our electricity works uh, with basically we've got power lines coming along both sides of the road. Not a big fan of that. But let's come in and add some paths uh, and join that up some various spots uh, so that the public can enjoy and add some trees in as well. So we have that connected in. 
Uh, what's important to note about these facilities, they tend to be uh, secured. So I'm going to come in and I'm just going to put in some fencing. And I think our park fence will do fine here. In fact, let's just push back the train just a bit. And that's just to give a little more space for that fence to go around. Get rid of those trees. And let's take another <laughs> crack at this fence to make it a little more square. I think it looks a little better. So that looks a heck of a lot better than these things over here. So we have them all connected. So let's come in and disconnect. Sorry, just before we do, we are currently at 994,000. And we've dropped down to 723, which is fairly on par with our sewage capacity, which will now allow us to come into our budget. And let's try this at 85%. See where that brings us. We can go even lower. Decide to keep it at 75%. Look at that. I think this facility looks a lot more organic and I think it fits well within the view shed here of the city. Uh, so we continue to basically make look to make better use of this land over here. So let's quickly uh, do a detailing uh, time lapse and I'll be right back.
So we have our new uh, water pump station. I'm really loving it compared to the original vanilla water pumps. I think this looks very realistic. Oh, well, and the thanks to Ivanya for building these assets that are available in the workshop. Uh, so they are obviously modeled after some real buildings and they look, look great. And I love the little nice little nature park that we have just on top of here. It's getting some use. And of course, uh, you know, things are looking good. Now, uh, you can probably see something that I want to take care of next episode, so stay tuned for that. Uh, I'm going to leave you here with a little cinematic outro. But if you did like today's video, please be sure to like, share, and subscribe. Leave a comment down below. Let me know what you think of uh, today's episode. And until next time, bye for now.